Hi everyone, I am going to start a new uh, video on acrylic painting and you have already, uh, part one was me texturizing this canvas. So I've already texturized it and I have put a coat of acrylic paint on it all over. So um, now I'm going to start with my mark making that I usually do with almost every painting that I do is I will start with mark making and I will explain to you the different types of materials or, and tools that I'm using, okay? So I want to show you some new, something new that I just bought. It's called uh, the Art Crayon and it's by Marabou and it's for mixed media and it is a watercolor crayon but they're very very creamy um, similar to the crayon d'ache and they come in different sets this set here has the different blues and purples in it and then the uh, one of the other sets is the green set which is uh, teal yellow and green and then there's a red set which I've already taken out of the container, and these are um, your uh, reds and pinks and oranges. And the other set is the neutral set, and that comes in um, black and white and uh, kind of a Titan buff and a chocolate. And the bottoms, uh, you can see that's the actual color of the uh, stick itself and it, uh, to use it you just take the top off and uh, turn and turn it so I'm gonna try that this is the first time and it's been recommended to me and here you go and you can see you can turn it as you turn it the uh, material comes out of the container but can you see how creamy that is it's wonderful That was, that was the uh, black. The, I couldn't tell if that was the black or the brown. But it is a water soluble. Now I want to do some of the, the white one as well. Turn it up or turn it down. There's too much out of it. Oh, look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Wow. It is so creamy. Very, very creamy. I really like it. I can see me buying these all the time. I got these off of uh, Amazon. But I understand that Jerry's, Artorama, Dick Blix, Cheap Joe's, they all have it now. So I highly recommend these. I love it. And I am going to use a black marker. And the reason why I'm doing different, different things is that I want to have different types of marks. I want thin marks, thick marks. I'm not thinking, I'm just making a lot of marks on here. And this is a marker. This is charcoal. It's just a piece of charcoal. And I'm going to smear that charcoal. cracking on me, which is okay.
here's another marker. This is a kind of a pink marker. I don't know if you can, if that's going to show up. That doesn't really show up that much. So I'm going to forget about that. And it's just picking up other stuff. So this is um, Jerry's Art Aroma Jet Black, it's called. I really like it. It's a nice thin line. It's a much thinner line than what's on there now. thinner than what is already on there. Um, this is one of my favorite pencils. I always use this. This is made by Stabilo and it's for paper, glass, plastic, and metal. It doesn't show up much on here, but once I uh, seal this, it's really going to show up. And it's a nice thin line, which I like. This is just a graphite pencil, just like a regular lead pencil. And of course, I couldn't, I wouldn't have to put this on. This is the Arthraft. Comes in little discs. Okay, now